All right, guys, then we're Blue Beetle. Now, before we do it, don't forget to like, subscribe, and kill location by Reyes album. So, Blue Beetle is a superhero film. It's based on a DC Comics character, Jaime Reyes, Blue Beetle, and it's the 14th installment in the DC Extended Universe. Um, the film stars Zola Maraduna as Jaime Reyes, Blue Beetle, alongside Bruna, Marquenzi, Adriana, Barraza, Damien, Alcazar, Raul, Max, Trujillo, Susan Sarandon, and George Lopez. And, um, so yeah, this movie was, um, so basically, um, you have a teenager, Jaime Reyes, who basically gets, um, a Blue Beetle Scarab, and, uh, basically, um, basically gets attached to him, and then he becomes a Blue Beetle, and he has to use it to try and save his family from, um, um, Jenny Cord, um, played by Susan Sarandon, and I thought this was great, I, I remember when they announced Blue Beetle, years ago, it was a couple years ago, um, it was going to be um, a straight to streaming movie. Um, it was going to be on HBO Max, that along with Batgirl, but um, they cancelled Batgirl. And Blue Beetle, they, instead of putting HBO Max, put this. I'm kind of happy they put in cinemas. And it came out today. And I enjoyed it. I thought the cast was good. I like Zolo, Mario Duna. He was good. Um, I loved him as Blue Beetle, Hummy Reyes. Susan Sarandon was good. I love George Lopez. Bruno Marconzi was good as um, uh, Jenny Cord. And, um, and yeah, so. And yeah, it was a good movie. Um, and yeah, it was a good solo movie. Um, uh, so yeah, um, uh, so the villain was good. I, I, so it was Victoria Cord, not Jenny Cord. Jenny Cord is um, Bruna's character. Um, uh, so Susan Sarandon's in this, and I thought it was good. I thought the jokes were good. I thought the visuals were good. The suit, the suit, Blue Beetle was amazing. I'm happy they did practical and they didn't do CGI. And I saw the trailers, and I thought it was great. And you should go watch this movie. Um, it's a really good movie, and. Um, so yeah, I enjoyed it. I might, I'll give it an 8 out of 10. I really enjoyed it. Um, I'm happy this went cinemas. And, um, so yeah, now we only have one more DC movie, and that's Aquaman's Kingdom in December. Looking forward to it. And then the DC's done. Now we're in the DC Universe. Um, James Gunn already said that um, uh, Blue Beetle will be carried over to the DC Universe. And I hope he does. So it, it, it doesn't really matter if this movie bombs or it doesn't do well. Because because um, James Gunn said he, was, he said he was going to use the character. He didn't say he would use the movie. So anything that happens in this movie, he might not use it. He'll just use the character. But if it does well, we might get a sequel. But yeah, it's good. I thought Zolo one of the best castings. He was good. He was Aunt Mireya's. I, I can't see anyone else playing this character. Um, I know Zolo from Cobra Kai. He was good in that. I love him as Miguel. Um, this was this was actually his first movie, by the way. And um, yeah, this is good. I give it an eight out of ten. Uh, I just hope this does well because we had Shazam: Fury of the Gods earlier this year. We had a Flash didn't do well. I think this might do well. I think Aquaman might do well. And that's pretty much it. That's Blue Beetle. Go check it out. I love the family aspect. I thought it was emotional, heartbreaking. And it was good. I loved the story. I thought it was great. I loved the music. Who did the music, by the way? It was, um, the music was by Bobby Krillick. And yeah, it was good. Great movie. Um, Zola was good as Blue Beetle. And yeah, give it an 8 out of 10. So guys, so much for my videos. My next one. Bye.